Before me to say something about uh, our father, I want to say thank you once again. I know that one finger is he can do anything himself. It's the same as ourselves, we can do anything if you are not. But because because of you, your mind and what you can help us is really important. As a family of Maneno, we say thank you and God bless you. Maremu alikuwa anaitwa kwa jina ya Maneno Mambwe Anakle. Uh, our father his name uh, Maneno uh, Mambwe Anakle. Anakle. Ni mzaliwa pale Mark Baraka. He was born in Baraka. Kwenye familia ya Bashirinda and that's family of Bashirinda. Alizaliwa mwaka 1953. He was born in 19 uh, 15 53. Baba yake alikuwa anaitwa kwa jina ya Ahongo Sungula wa Mambwe. And his father was named Ahongo uh, Sungula Mambwe. Kwenye jamaa la Bashiri ndio hivyo hivyo. And the same the family of Bashinda. Nyumba ya Bashi Mambwe. And the, the house of Bashi Mambwe. Mama yake alikuwa anaitwa kwa jina ya Ana Chabusiku. His mom was named uh, Ana Chabusiku. Mtoto wa jamaa ya Batumba Bafulero. She came in the, the family of Batumba Bafulero. Elimu aliyofanya at the school he went wala kazi aliyofanya maishani or the job he does when he was in life Maremu alisoma shule msingi msimbaki baraka uh, the father he was going to school of a secondary in baraka akaendelea na masomo ya secondary kaleni kwenye shule ya institute sendwe so he went in primary and go to secondary and uh, kalemi na hapo hapo ndiko nyali patia cheti kikubwa cha high school and in that place he get a diploma for high school mwaka 1975 yes they you am swai maremu alishuhudia sana na kazi ya walimu and he was really a teacher kwani miaka 13 and uh, uh, 18 years baada akaingia mkazi ya biashara and then he went to be a businessman vile vile alio alio kimbia kambini nyaruguso alifanya kazi na world food program and when he was in camp of refugees he worked with all the food uh, program akamalizia kazi yake na kuwa supervisor and he finished to be a supervisor 
And then he go to be a farmer, doa, and then now married. Maremo alioa wanawake. Our father he he went married the woman. Nakabatia kuzawa watoto saba. And he get to birth, to have seven kids. Katia wavulana watatu. Among of wavulana juu na ume. Among of the boys. Wasichana wamne. And the girl four. Wajuku ishinamne. And the grandchildren fourteen. Namtukuluza umoja. Twenty four. Yeah. Twenty ah twenty four. And then mujukuluza. And sorry. Grandkids. Grandkids one. Thank you. Jumla ameacha familia ya watu salasi namna namoja. Salasi namoja. Thirty one. Okay. That all is a thirty one. Magonjwa and sickness. Maremo aligonjwa magonjwa ya rat. And our father he wanted to have a disease of kidney. Estoma. And estoma is you from English. Estoma. Thank you. Maini na tension. And the maini na tension. Come on. Say me again. And then for a long time, and then he came to die. And then he, he died on Sunday. Now he lived all his life six. six. Sixty-seven. Sixty-seven. Thank you. Mungu alitupa. God who give us. Na mungu ametoa. And the God too. Na la bwana libarikiwe. And the name of God be blessed. Amen. 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 Asad sa. Enu e molonge. Na ima na anu chini la ba bondo baste ya kwenye rikete. Enu taki tena iri nyobo na shukuru manga. Ah, ya, ya. Eh, ni na furaha kuona na shima maapa. I'm so happy to see how I stand in front of you. Ini kama msimani, as the leader of the heaven. Ni na shukuru watu wote ambayo leo walichangia kwa imada na kuifikisha siku yake ya mwisho. I say thank you for all of you to support us and to finish this today. Hii inamaanisha kama upendo kati yetu unapaswa uwe hivi hivi sababu hii sio shida ya kwanza wala itakuwa shida ya mwisho. This show us that we need to live a life of love and this is not the first problem and the last problem. Kwa hiyo tukamatane kama vile wanafungaka kuni kwenye kamba moja na njoo nguvu and now i ask you to be together as you have something you type one place so that can be strong kazi mulifanya ili tufanikishi kitu mnajua marekani maziko ni kitu kinaomba pesa nyingi lakini kwa nguvu zenu tumefika leo hapa kuzika ndugu yetu kwa moyo wa mapenzi na nguvu zetu zimefanya kazi what you done is really important because you know in america to have this service or ceremony is not easy, but because of love, we put together and now we turn it. Now I'm asking you, uh, let us be together, Power. don't be less, when we get a problem like this one, let us be first. After this service, what 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 are we here for family? I wanna mlungula. Of us, we gonna go to Alex's family. Kwa sababu ceremony kidogo ya watu wakumi maji wanyo uji. Because we have some war over there, you can take. Baada ya vile nazani tuta sambaza muda uyo wakiliyo kwa muda. After that, I think that we can separate and by time. 
neno langu la mwisho ni kuwashukuru sana watu wote wako hapa na kazi waliofanya my last word is just to say thank you and uh, once again for what you done nasema asante sana baada ya hii kazi ni kukamata magari turudie pale tena na baada ya pale kila mtu atachukua After this, we need to took our car or to take our car, and everybody gonna go to Alex's family, and we gonna meet over there. Nasema asante sana kwa kanisa ambayo yimulea maneno. Let me say thank you once again to the church of Fort Bat. I want to begin with a few sentences from scripture. Inaenda kimbia ndani ya maandiko matakatifu. Okay. I am the resurrection and I am the life. Says the Lord. Whoever has faith in me shall have life even though he die. And everyone who has life and has committed himself to me in faith shall not die forever. Amen. Please pray with me. We thank you, Lord, for the life of our brother Maneno. Uh, we thank you for his family and all of his friends and the love they have for one another and the way they support one another. We ask for your mercy, for your grace, that you would console his children, his grandchildren, his friends, all of those who knew him, console them with your comfort and love, we pray, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I want to uh, read to you from the 23rd Psalm. After I read it, Pastor Joshua will read. Uh, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the paths of righteousness. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And then here is the, the great promise. Hallelujah! Yeah. <laughs> 
ya jauh Thank you. 